forewarn weather with Damian Lotus. Not only are we getting much needed beneficial rainfall across the state, but the rainfall is going to help keep our temperatures out of the triple digits. So it's really a win win here for the state of Oklahoma. Let's get you ready for the latest here on your early Sunday morning. I'll start you off with a statewide view of our storm scanner and overall that first wave of showers, storms and severe weather that is now starting to continue to work its way off to the east. But replacing it is a second round of showers and storms here for northwestern and western parts of the state. There is one storm in particular that I am watching very closely. It's a storm just passing through Thomas right now. Earlier was producing some small hail just to the west of Putnam. Overall, the storm motion is going to be off to the east and off to the southeast, moving about 20 to 30 miles an hour. Over the past couple of scans, you can see the intensity of the storm has come down, which is some good news. It's not really producing any hail anymore, but some heavy rainfall, definitely going to be some blinding rainfall approaching I-40 here to the west of the Oklahoma City Metro. So this storm, if it holds together, it will have an impact here on central and southern parts of the Oklahoma City Metro. Across northern parts of the state, we got some light showers continuing here across I-35. On down the line, we got some spotty showers here along Highway 81 between Hennessy, Dover, Kingfisher, Okarchi. So we will see some showers here for northern parts of the Metro for your early Sunday. As of right now, no organized rainfall, some sprinkles here for the Metro, but that's going to be about it until those other storms start to move in. South of the Oklahoma City Metro, we got some light and spotty showers here from Paul's Valley and Winniewood. These are going to continue to drift their way off to the east across southwestern Oklahoma. Just cloudy skies and some breezy winds here across southwestern parts of the state. Off to our west, there's that one storm there south of Thomas. I put the lightning on for this one, so you'll definitely hear some rumbles of thunder as those storms are approaching. But other than that, that's going to be the main storm. We also have some spotty showers continuing to develop across Northwestern Oklahoma. These look like they will be able to maintain, so we are not done with the rainfall just yet, but we still have some broad areas and some light to moderate, even some pockets of heavy rainfall continuing here for your early Sunday morning. Temperature wise, pretty mild out there. 60s and 70s here across the metro. Same thing for the rest of the state, especially where it's been raining, and we also have some breezy north winds. That's going to help keep our temperatures out of the hundreds here for majority of the state. Your hour by hour forecast here for the rest of your Sunday. Partly cloudy skies. Highs today will make it to the 90s, not hundreds, 90s. Really nice for this afternoon. Sunset's going to be right around 830 this evening. So here's your highs across the state for this afternoon. 80s to our north, 90s across the majority of the state. And we will still see some triple digit heat across far southwestern parts of Oklahoma. Looks like we'll tap 93 today. My forecast high here for Oklahoma City. There will be some lingering thunderstorm chances here across eastern Oklahoma as we head into this afternoon. So we'll be watching out for that. For your seven day forecast today is going to be partly cloudy. It's going to be breezy and it will be warm. With that excess humidity, it will make it feel hot. It will still feel like the 100s here for today. We're not done with the rainfall chances just yet. I will be tracking some pretty good rainfall chances for the next couple of days, especially on Tuesday. And then after that, we will maintain in the 80s for the next couple of days. Some triple digits on that seven day plus four more. But overall, our forecast for this week, it's going to be kind of like the Dallas Cowboys. We're going to peak in the 90s. Ooh, <laughs> there. <Learn. Yeah. laughs> Thank you, Davian.